Hello everyone, my name is Saad Iqbal and I'm from imcivilengineer.com So today we're going to talk about the Waffles Lab. I'm glad that you have asked me where the Waffles Lab system is. You've asked this question because Waffles Lab is not that common throughout the world. It's not like a flat slab which is here and there everywhere and 90% chances that the slab shielding you from blue sky above you would also be a flat slab. So as it is not that common, that's why the people don't know what is Waffel slab, how Waffel slab is constructed, or what are the benefits one can draw in from kicking in the Waffel slab. Previously, I have used the word flat slab, and by that I mean the slab that has level surface from both the top and the soffit. The Waffel slab is also sometimes termed as ribbed slab system, but you would find it interesting to know that ribbed and Waffel slab are somehow two different things. When one say ribbed slab, it is actually a one-way spanning system with ribs which, as in a Waffel slab, the joints form a two-way system. Waffel slabs are really deeper than rib slab, but they have a thin topping slab with narrow ribs. However, column heads or band beams are of the same depth as the ribs. The Waffel slab system can be called as a two-way joint slab system which comprises of ribs constructed in perpendicular direction. So here if you cut a section somewhere in the middle, you would be able to see the ribs like this. Waffel slabs are most suitable for construction of slabs with long span. Slabs that have span greater than 16 meters can make use of a Waffel slab design. The, this baffle features in slabs will help to take up heavy loads. Actually, the introduction of sport hoists made waffle slab very stiff. Actually, the introduction of sport hoists made waffle slab very stiff. Technically speaking, stiffness is actually the force that is required to produce unit deflection in a structure. So if the greater the force is required, the structure would be more stiff and vice versa. Waffel slab construction will give the underside of the slab structure a different type of aesthetic appearance. The slab will have a waffel appearance underside, but the top surface of the slab will be smooth. The waffle slab construction follows two methods, waffle slab with solid heads and the waffle slab with band beams. The former type will have solid heads at the joints with columns. This provision is made to bear the shear requirements faced during loading conditions. In the second type of construction, a wide solid beam is provided along the center line of the column which will facilitate the structure to have a uniform depth. In waffle slab, the waffles are formed as domes-like structure which is in general are of standard dimensions. The size of the domes, it depends on the depth of the ribs or joists. It is recommended to avoid the domes near to the columns or near its vicinity. In practice, the ribs are connected from the columns and the beams. The number of domes formed will vary based on the span length and the loading conditions. This would also affect the number of solid strips that are running between the columns in both the perpendicular direction. As mentioned in the introduction, the Waffel slab form a combination of ribs or grillage that are running parallel and are perpendicular to each other. This hence form an orthogonal assembly. This arrangement will have voids between the ribs. These voids can be either square or round or of any dimension based on the construction pods that are used. The pods are actually unit of formwork that are e evenly spaced spacers and are usually made of plastic. The pod can be square, cellular, EPS blocks or light matte material as well. Formwork is installed followed by the installation of the waffle pods and then the reinforcement fixing and then the final condition is the concreting and followed by the removal of the formwork and finishing of the concrete. The main advantages of the waffle slab are as follows, highly economical in construction when compared with the conventional slab construction. These types of slab can take up higher amount of dead and other load coming effectively. Different applications are in hotels, theaters, showrooms, and halls where it is necessary to have large column-wide spaces. Waffle slab proved to be attractive both structurally and aesthetically. So that's all from the Waffle slab. Please subscribe to our YouTube channel and be updated.